I, uh, I mean, you know what I mean? Like, you see the green candle? That means it, it, it closed it, it closed lower than where it opened. But still, that's a big that's a big day. And other people are going to note that, too. And then you see the short interest, right? Tremendous short interest. And I keep on – oh, and a, a reminder for folks, right? I mean, this channel is educational in nature, not providing advice or anything like that. But generally speaking, remove that – remove GME, remove the ticker. Just betting on short squeeze, that's, that's dangerous to do, right? For us, it's a bit of a – for many of the people who share my – thesis it's a bit of a, a sideshow because there's a legitimate thesis uh, underlying this play but that said it, it needs to be talked about in a reminder too when i'm tweeting out like the short squeeze tough and the graphics like we're trying to have a have, it's like a it's something that i don't think enough people are talking about right but that's not something to, to bet on if it happens that's great all else equal you like that price to take off um but still it's very difficult to time that type of stuff and even to even know if it's going to happen like i even i say i'm not even so sure i don't really have the expertise to say whether or not something is like that is likely to happen but that said i'm aware of that short interest it's definitely something to pay attention to and as far as we know what's what's surprising to me and many of us i think is that the short interest remained elevated as the last we heard and so that's kind of what's surprising to me especially if it has re remained high um, so we'll have to see. When do we get the update? Probably, uh, oh, it's gonna, I guess it's a, it's a little while away. But um, I'm kind of curious about that too, right? Because like how, now this price action is starting to get real. If it breaks through, like if it breaks through to this level and we're at 18, 19, 20, low 20 range, like remember I talked about getting shaken out, but again, I, I don't really know about that. But in this particular case, we have an actual thesis. Uh, so if you, if you get the longer term time frame, then uh, it's kind of just like, hey, it's a, it's a nice to have if it happens. But uh, I just saw a lot of people talking about that squeeze stuff, so I just wanted to to warn on that front because even I myself don't have high confidence in that stuff. But I, I, you gotta note it. I felt that not even enough people were talking about it. I'm like, you gotta talk about this stuff. Hasn't it? Like I've never even seen such high short interest relative to the shares outstanding, but relative to my bull feet, like how, how confident I was in the bull. Feet. Anyway, um, so that's uh, so just a big day on the big a big couple of days, right? Just this is the daily. So you saw. I don't even. When was the last time we streamed? This day, right? So it was uh, right in that. It's only up. What's crazy is that it's only up about twenty percent, right? Is this right? When was the last time we streamed? The twenty third. It's only up about twenty percent from our last stream on the close. I know. I realize it was higher than that intraday today, but um, it's it's only up twenty percent. But what's happening is right. This, it seems like the story's getting out there and the charts breaking out. Blah blah blah. So uh, wouldn't you know, as soon as that broke out on that, uh, it did, it's funny how some of these things tend to coincide. It's just kind of a bit curious. So everything's a test and blah, blah, blah. But let's see if the story takes.